my name is Michelle Webb and I'm the principal here at Henry County High School. We wanted to spend some time with you today just to talk about school for the 2020-21 school year. To our returning students who are 11th and 12th graders and their parents, we have missed you and we are so excited to get learning going through Henry County High School. For our incoming 10th graders and your parents, just know that we are excited to meet you and to um, help you in this transition process as you move from Grove to the high school. Some of you have never been on our campus and so regardless of who you are, um, whether you're a 10th grade um, student who is new to our building or you're a 12th grader ready to spend your third year with us, just know that we're here this year to help you walk through the process. We know that it is going to be a different year, but we have made plans and we have a great plan in place. To start out today, we're going to um, spotlight some areas that are new to you. Um, over the time that we have not been here, um, we have some new things going on on campus, so we want to show those to you and give you some information about that. Okay, so come on in and let's show you around. Okay, so we're ready to take our tour and we wanted to start with some of our new area that opened in March, but you've not really had a chance to see. So parents, when you come to Henry County High School, this is where you'll enter into our front main entrance. Our students will enter into a different area and we'll talk about that in a little bit, but come on in and let's take a look at Miss Velvet's new area. Okay, so parents, if you were to come into the school counseling office, you would be able to leave Ms. Velvet's office and come this way. Students who will be entering the counseling office will be coming down a different secure hallway. And so we have three school counselors. Our 10th grade counselor is Ms. Callie Blunt. Our 11th grade counselor is Ms. Amanda Armstrong. And our senior counselor is Ms. Becky Bullion. Those ladies would love to help you. So again, we're here for you. Um, let us know how we can help you and they are your resources. Also, Ms. Penny Faith works in this office and she is our school registrar. So when you need transcripts, um, if you're needing help getting on the parent email list, she's gonna be your contact for that. And so um, this is our new beautiful um, school counseling office that we are so excited to have. Another exciting thing for us this year is that Nurse Kim has a new space. Um, she has a larger area to treat students who are having health concerns, and we have options for privacy as well. Also, just with knowing that this year is going to be different, um, parents and students know that we have lots of extra safety precautions in place. You can keep an update uh, on knowing what those are by um, continuing to follow us, um, and then also those will be continuously updated on our school website as well. So just know that we're here to take care of your students. We have plans in place for that, and um, we are excited about Nurse Kim having a new area. So here we are in the new Henry County High School Library. We are so excited. It looks much different than the last time you were here. And so we um, have just lots of updates that have happened. We celebrated our 50th anniversary last year and it was time that the library got a facelift and it has indeed done that. And so we're excited. We're starting to move back in and it will be up and ready um, for you this school year. Okay, so a little bit ago we saw where parents would come in if they're coming into the school. And so here is our new front entrance. So bus riders will come up under the awning and enter in this area. Um, just to let you know if you're a car rider or a car driver, a couple of other spots that you can enter would be our C2 entrance over at the tennis courts or the E entrance across from the field house. Um, parents, just to let you know, we'll put some additional information out through our parent email, so be watching for that. Um, but I did want to give you a few tips. I think the thing that is most stressful for students on the first days of school um, are how to get around the buildings, and I'm just going to be real honest. Our buildings are complicated, but I want to give you a few tips that might help you along. And we're going to be helping you find your way, so don't stress about that, but I'm going to give you a few tips that might be helpful just a little bit. We have five buildings on campus, and they are labeled buildings A, B, C, D, and E. Now, I don't have tips for all of them, but let me um, tell you what I do have. Building A 
Think of the arts. Building A is around the theater. A theater is full of people who are artistic. Our visual art department is also in that building. And so building A is for the arts. Building B, when we think of B, we can say the word books. And so building B is where the library is. So if you have a class in building B, know that you're gonna be looking for the library where the books are. If you are looking for a classroom in building C, Building C is the cafeteria, so C for cafeteria, that also is where the gym is. So building C, cafeteria, and the gym, so that's where you're gonna be looking for. D building, I'm sorry, I don't really have a good anything for that, but E building, if you think of E, the letter E has very straight lines if you look at a capital E, and building E is our newest building, and so it has very straight lines. The hallways are straight hallways, and our other buildings are round, so that's why it makes it a little bit more complicated. Once again, we know it's a little nerve-wracking. You are not alone, so do not be scared about that, and we're gonna help you, but that gives you a few tips that might help you as you come to school. Okay, so we hope that you have enjoyed your tour of the school today. Um, parents and students, we just want to remind you that we are here for you. We know that these are uncertain times and we want you to know that we are here to help you walk through that process. If you have questions, please call us. If you have concerns, please call us. Reach out to us. We can only fix a problem or a concern that we know about, so please let us know, and we are here to help you walk through um, this unusual school year. Just a couple of notes. Um, we do hope that you follow along with us. Um, I do a parent email on a very regular basis, so if you would like to have information on a regular basis, make sure you're receiving our parent emails, and we will put that um, way to get on that on the screen. Um, and then also know that we have a Facebook page that is very active. Make sure to follow that um, because we're here for you. We want to have a wonderful year in the best way that we can and let us know how we can help. Thanks so much and go Big Red.